Welcome to the Elbert T. Thatcher log cabin here. This was the home of the purported founder of Allegheny State Park, Elbert T. And you can see him on the kiosk in the front here, seated with his wife and his dog is in one of the pictures. And over there is one of the old Fancher pools that is across the street from me. And they filled that in shortly after building Quaker Beach and the Quaker Beach House and Quaker Lake. Anyways, this is now used as a, what they call a commissioner's cabin. In other words, dignitaries from New York State that come to visit the park are a lot of time in this, as well as park interns. So folks that are training in that get to stay in this uh, beautiful little cottage here. And uh, it's interesting, it is an authentic log cabin on piers with an authentic masonry fireplace. And around the back here, they have some beautiful stonework leading here to Quaker Run Creek and a rear entrance and you see that nice chimney up there. So anyways, they just refurbished this. The park carpenters did a bang up job here. Both the bathroom and the kitchen were completely remodeled and I can tell you from experience, I'd filmed this before, and that uh, they were kind of rough. And now uh, they just do a heck of a job, the park carpenters do it. Always amazed uh, at their skill. So there's the fireplace. It does have air conditioning and then they put in propane or electric heat in this. So this is the front bedroom here. Nice and cozy. And then the rear bedroom. In which you can look right out the window there at the creek. It's pretty cool. But uh, this is not for rent for that reason. And uh, they have put fireplace inserts in all the masonry fireplaces in the park for safety's sake and also efficiency. There, You lose a little bit of ambiance, but you definitely gain a lot in their efficiency with respect to not all the heat going up the chimney. So this is the newly remodeled bathroom here. And this is custom carpentry work here by the park carpenters. And uh, they use a burning techniques and they distress the wood. Um, you can see the edges and everything, so it looks like it's hand hewn. And they use routers to make wormholes in the in the wood. It's pretty cool. So this is uh, this is sweet. Brand new shower, vanity, and toilet. And the old bathroom had a big old water tank exposed. Even the trim work here is uh, is quite rustic along the edges. And uh, I just love these unique touches here that the park carpenters put on here. So obviously this is the living room here with the oh semi cathedral ceiling, uh, a bit vaulted. Uh, nice little dining snack counter right here built in and uh, of course uh, one of the larger tables and some of this furniture is probably decades old not probably uh, for sure decades old here and uh, and a beautiful new kitchen cabinets and new appliances to boot so it is a nicely appointed cabin it is cozy it's not huge but um, boy it's uh, it's sweet so this is the Albert T. Fancher log cabin here not to be confused with the Fancher Cottages, but they were named after Albert Fancher and uh, also the Fancher Pool. So that is a tour and we're right out here on ASP3 across from Angle Trail and if you look over there that cabin was recently moved from the opposite side of the road and that's where the lifeguards used to stay when they uh, guarded the Fancher Pool here and right in front of this along this beautiful new bike path is an informational informational kiosk here that you can read up on this and uh, but if there are people here chances are they don't want to be disturbed so uh, anyways you folks have a great Allegheny day thanks for watching stay safe out there take care